there is a question relating to the energy i have said that energy cannot be destroyed can it be dissolved this is the question in this light there are few things which we need to understand first how does this energy is created first we know that how the energy is created then we will know its effect and then can it be dissolved in one word if i have to say if energy can be destroyed no energy cannot be destroyed and can it be dissolved before that there is something the energy that you have created what is going to happen to that you have to understand this in the our day to day terminology first suppose a man commits a crime and he continues to plead that he is not guilty but everybody knows that he is guilty he is pleading that he is not guilty what happens the case will continue but on the contrary if he agrees that he is mistaken he committed a mistake committed a crime then there is a possibility that there will be mercy on him his punishment could be reduced so too if energy has been created and you are aware then its effects are reduced you know that you have done something and there is a punishment for it because of awareness you will accept it lovingly and willingly then you will not feel the intensity of it it is something like this a man got into an accident on the highway but there is no one to take care of he is still alive but pinned under the the steering he will have to undergo suffering and pain but if all of a sudden somebody comes and takes care of the person removes him from under the wheel and immediately he is carried to the hospital that is one step and even if he is carried to the hospital there is a possibility that he can get instant treatment or there may be a delay for some reason or the other when we look deep into why all these things happen it is the outcome of our energies that we create and there is no understanding suppose a person is living a life of awareness in that situation what will happen to him immediate everything will happen immediately as a punishment he has to undergo as a process he has to undergo through that accident because the thoughts have created an energy that energy has to be dissolved but he is aware he accepts it and in that acceptance immediately he is given care of as soon as he reaches to the hospital he is immediately taken care of there are nurses there are doctors so what will happen is pain will be reduced tremendously and because of his awareness that energy which could cause more serious problems will be dissolved a person ordinarily can say that i am a church goer i am very highly religious person why do these problems come to me if you were really in that way then there would have been an understanding when miseries and misfortunes and things like these come they are the outcome of your past doings if you are getting a problem today in solving your problems with the office file or it is delayed it is because you have left it incomplete you ran behind your some other kind of entertainment and you leave that file incomplete so next day when you have 
come, you have to complete that file. There had been many incidents. The scriptures are full of those kind of incidents. But first of all, we have to know how does this energy is created. When we speak a word out of unconsciousness, it creates an energy. For instance, two people are sitting in a room and are antagonistic to one another. They are not aware of the fact that the couch that they are sitting rests on the same ground. Your space that you are occupying is overlapping. You are breathing the same air that I am exhaling and vice versa. You are drawing the energy from the same electricity, same electrical bulb and not only that, also what it is happening, there is one air conditioner that is giving breeze to both of you. Yet still we are antagonistic. We are at non-speaking terms. This is lack of awareness or understanding. We have to remember that we are part of the one synergistic harmony. You and I may be sitting down in the same car, but I have uttered something which you did not like, so you are not talking to me. But we are trapped, being carried by the same vehicle. The same driver is carrying us. The awareness says that we are part of this one synergistic harmony means the same sun that gives us light, the same moon, the same sky, the same earth, the same road that we travel on. When all these things are in common, that what it is that creates the difference is our understanding. That we need to change. And because of this, we create negative and positive energies. How the negative energy can be dissolved if too much of the positive energy is coming. In electrical terminology it is called searching of the voltage. There is a fluctuation of the voltage. What it does? It causes the damage to your electrical appliances. For that each electrical appliance have a mechanism embedded into it that it protects itself from the fluctuations in the voltage. In the same way, your consciousness is the protection that protects you from creating this, uh, the disturbances in the flow of the energy. The fluctuation in the voltage is the disturbance in the flow of energy. It is regulated by the internal mechanism of your electrical appliance. As an individual, this is happening. You are going, all of a sudden there is a traffic jam. Somebody gives you a bad drive. Somebody says something that it is not pleasant to you. Or you get the sight of someone that you had not liked. Or someone who has said unpleasant things about you sometimes. So what have that moment, immediately there happens a fluctuations in our energy levels and that create the disturbance in our consciousness. If there is an awareness, how can I be antagonistic if this person is doing that way? That is his way because Probably he does not have the opportunity or understanding or the company that can direct him towards the harmony. So you are compassionate towards that person. But you are not acting negatively. You have observed that your, the children may say certain things, but you know that this is a child. Child may say anything. But you are a grown-up person, sometimes it is said. If that person has said, but you are a grown-up person, how could you react in that way? In the same way, 
you are following the path of awareness. How can you react ignorantly in that manner? When this comes in the first place, there will be no wrong energy will be created in you. But you remember you have lived a part of your life that has been unconscious, that lacked the awareness. So you have to face that. But if there is an awareness, you will accept, yes, that was my mistake. What is my fault? I take the full responsibility of my mistake. In that, immediately, what it is happening here? A positive pole is created through your awareness. And in that, a possibility exists that it can neutralize the negative effects completely or gives you an opportunity that your effects of that, the impact of this that it would have created otherwise in the absence of awareness will be reduced tremendously. If you continue to plead that you are not guilty, no one can have mercy on you. And you remember Hindus say that there are three aspects of our actions. When you come into today is your new day. Today is the outcome of until today came, it was, it appeared, it came into existence as tomorrow because yesterday. But it is between yesterday and Tomorrow there is today. Now, whatever has happened in the past, it cannot be undone unless you are now. Now is the opportunity that you can correct your mistakes. So you have already accumulated certain actions. You have spoken some things to your mother, to your spouse, to your friend, something unpleasant. And because of that, there is absence of any communication. Today, now is the time that you can correct the mistake. You approach from your side and you apologize to the person. Then tomorrow will unfold in a different way. After that moment when you are approaching from your side to apologize, the person realizes mistake and he approaches from his side. Two of you meet midway and then both of you are ready to say something. The person says, no, no, there is no need. I understand you have come and that's finished. Let's shake our hands. Let's give a hug and let us go to celebrate. So what has happened that there, there are accumulated actions. That was what you did yesterday. You spoke in the words that cause unpleasantness to the person talking terms vanished. Now, if there is no awareness, if there is no approach of reconciliation, then this will continue into the future. It will create a new future. But if in the moment of nowness, you immediately realize the mistake and apologize to the person, its effects will be neutralized. So awareness is the only methodology that neutralizes the effects. So what actually happens? If there is too much of positive energy, awareness creates the antidote of it. If there is too much negative energy, again the awareness creates the antidote of it in the form of positive energy. That's why at times Master says, that if you are too much of the negative energy, he uses his positive energy to neutralize your energy. And if there is too much of positive energy, that is also harmful. Because you remember if too much of one kind of electric current is surging into that, into your electrical bulb, the bulb blows. And this is what happens there when there is a fluctuations in the voltage your appliances get damaged. But the bigger appliances have a mechanism. The electrical bulbs and things like these do not have that kind of in embedded mechanism. 
that it can offset the surging of the voltage so the bulb blows so in the same way your words that you speak that creates energy it can be negative it can be it can have a negative effect it can have positive effect and that if so that now when i say the effect then it energy is created and it cannot be destroyed yes it can be dissolved if you are at loggerhead with someone with your spouse you come to your master you speak to your problem he gives you an understanding he shares with you his insights in that way that is dissolved so you can create the awareness these moments of awareness awareness is light and when you create these moments of awareness then you can uh, yourself can create that that situation when the energies can be the negative energies can be dissolved any kind of energy negative and positive they are not they are antidote to one another there is nothing wrong in the negative energy and nothing wrong in the positive energy and there is nothing right in either of the two can electric bulbs say that negative energy is right wrong and and positive energy is right no both are necessary can you say that left foot does more work than the right foot no both feet are necessary for walking because it is the harmony it is the balance between the left and the right foot that makes the movement it is the balance between the right hand and the left hand that creates the balance it is the balance between the right hemisphere of the brain and the left hemisphere of the brain that creates the balance and makes you a balanced and harmonious person blissful person bliss if we say the bulb that gives you the light we can say that is the bliss of the bulb that is manifesting as an interaction between the negative and the positive pole when both neutralize one another if one is more then if the negative pole is missing or corroded the battery will not the car will not move the bulb will not light if too much of positive current is coming then there will be fluctuations and that can blow the bulb that is what happens so you have to be aware and with that awareness problem with your vehicle electrical problem you go to an electrician and he fixes the problem and the flow of the two energy becomes balanced and with that the problem is rectified so to awareness is the inner master that creates the balance that is necessary and if what we do we give too much importance to the words and that creates a disturbance you are too much careful about the words the same word if someone says to you out of pleasantness out of joy i remember when we were small when the master says you are you are stupid how you are acting like a dotish person it does not disturb you because it is the tonal quality with which it is said the that the energy that these words bring behind it makes the difference word has no meaning but when we give our own essence somebody had said something to you and because there was already disturbance in you if you are sad or melancholy if somebody says something even pleasant how you are sitting all by yourself what happened because there is already disturbance those words will come like a bullet and you may not like those words this is what creates the problems i will keep this morning session up to here yes indeed in response to your question the energy that is created cannot be destroyed its effect can be reduced it can be dissolved with awareness effects can be reduced you got because of your carelessness 
in the spiritual terms carelessness means lack of awareness you got your hand damaged but if it is immediately taken care of its process of healing will be intensified and the pain that you have to go through in the absence of this immediate instant care would be more now your pain will be less and there are people who are very loving to you during that moment of your illness during that moment of lack of awareness which is a sort of illness and during that moment the presence of those people loving and caring people will reduce the intensity of that and finally you will have the capability to bear that pain because someone is there to take care of and the person has the pain you say no that's all right i can bear that pain. but if the situation was different can you see the same thing so what happens the presence of the master presence of the man of awareness presence of awareness within you acts as panacea and takes care of gives you strength gives you understanding gives you courage to bear all that another aspect which i call as the words and the meaning and lack of awareness between this at that moment when a word is uttered and the meaning reaches you energy is created it can be positive it can be negative it can be destructive it can be constructive it can be pleasant it can be unpleasant i will speak on this aspect word and the meaning so that you are able to understand this process that takes place a little better and you are creating your own embedded the surge protection instead of going sometimes when you are running the electrical appliance it is said that you use the surge protection the, your awareness is the surge protection in you 